Hi, dyslexic genius here, Brad Hurt. My phone number is 864-236-1680. This is the B19 I bought. I have a video on it. I'm going to show you how to tune this up. But what I first did was, I'm not a real big fan of the volume controls on Edison's, but there's two screws up here that hold it in place, and one screw here on the horn that holds it in place. So I, I always take these out of my machine. The tools you're going to need, some part, part bicycle uh, bearing grease, or you can use white lithium. Sewing machine oil. Small Phillips, a small Phillips screwdriver that will fit in that hole right there. One crescent wrench, one flashlight, and one screwdriver. So what I'm going to show you first is the mounting bolts right here where my finger is. Because the cabinets swell and contract all the time over 50, 60, 100 years, you should come in here and tighten these all up. I've already done that. The other thing is, now what are we looking at? This is your governor. This is the hard drive of the phonograph. And listen, that's just a little bit of play. This is the spring barrel. So what we're going to do in oiling the, this Edison dime disc, this is the oiling cup. So what you're going to do is take the sewing machine oil, and just fill that thing up. Then what you're going to do, let me move around to the other side. On the governor right here are the felts for the speed control. And you really want to put a little oil on the governor there and on the bottom. And now you want to do the spindle. The next thing you want to do is you want to pull the crank out. Get a little dab of grease. And you want to grease these threads. What happens is these are a little rusty. It's going to crank in. And what happens over years, you're going to crank and crank and crank and crank, and this is going to get stuck inside the shaft, the crankshaft. Now you can hear it running. Do you hear the sound? Okay. What that is, is the two winding gears for the spring barrel. First, we're going to run some grease on the drive gear just like that. It'll get all over everything. While it's running, you just want to oil that gear, grease the gear. And that's what I'm doing right here. We have to do the whole rotation of the gear. And now it's coming around. Now what you're going to do this gear right here where my flashlight is those are the winding gears. You want to put a little oil here Okay, on those pivots.
And while you crank the machine, you want to oil that gear. Ah, oh, that's better. You will have to clean up the oil. Next thing. Is the engagement lever right here. It moves the horn into position so it'll track. You want to put a little oil right there. You're going to have to come back and clean everything else. That works a lot better. Now while it's running, You can hear the motor. There we go. It's going to, when you oil these felts, it's going to throw oil out for a little bit. And that's a lot quieter. So we can stop it. And it should do that. That means it's running well. The other thing is, if you do a phonograph and you crank it all the way up and you play it all the way down, you let the motor run down, and you still have tension on the crank. There's a problem with like the spring barrel bearings or the spring barrel shaft. You have to clean those up. And like me on YouTube, and that's my tip for the day.